That's so right. Well, the annual Golden Globes is an amazing night, an exhilarating evening, not just for the pri privileged winners who get to raise the golden orb up into the air, but also for those of us who tune in to see who wore what on the red carpet. Well, of course, we know that our very own fashion director, Alexis Shafeme, is always on the pulse of what's hot and what's not, and she's given us a, her red carpet report. Alexis, so <laughs> good to have you here. Great to be here. Now, there were a lot of hits, a lot of misses, but who dazzled on the red carpet? I thought all in all, all this was really actually a great awards yeah. ceremony. Really, I thought everyone looked amazing. One of my personal favorites is definitely oh, Jen Jennifer Lawrence. Yes. I thought this was a really fashion forward look for her. I love that crop layer at the top with then the cutout detail over the waist and the hip. Yeah. Really accentuating her waist. I mean, look how tiny her waist looks what? there. Really, this is how fashion forward can be done so well. And I think it's, I'm so happy that she did it. Beautiful yeah. color as well. Yeah, she's an and Armani then, girl, that one. Hey? Yeah, stunning. Yeah. Jamie Alexander wearing a dress by Jenny. This is the super low plunge that was a bit of a trend on the red carpet. She looked absolutely magnificent. Hair and makeup as well, really, really on point. And then another um, actress that really also, in terms of hair and makeup, stunning, Lady Gaga wearing this black oh, velvet dress by Akia Versace, of course. Yes. I thought she looked like an old school Hollywood old school, goddess, yeah. you know? Yeah. And I mean, her form in that dress is also just stunning. I love this new Gaga, that it's more about fashion and less about costume. Please, can we keep her? Yes. I love her. She we need to stay. keep this Gaga. Yes. And then, of course, we've got um, Lily James looking absolutely ethereal in this Marquesa gown. Marquesa yeah. is really known for these really soft chiffon numbers. And I love this like slightly Grecian inspired Ooh, thing with just gorgeous. the shoulder. It's like subtly sexy. Yeah. And the color as well, not, not being too white, it's just perfect. Yeah. And, and then, then Alicia Vikander. Alicia Vikander in a beautiful Louis Vuitton number. Nice. I thought that this dress would have maybe looked terrible on someone else, but just looked spectacular on her. Yeah. Very simple, very high cut at the front. And then this low crossover back at the Stunning. back. She's super young, super slender, I mean beautiful and gorgeous tan too. Yeah. And then we talk about, you know, trends, yeah. you know, and Ooh. Jennifer Lopez. She killed it. This knockout. Girl. Hey, she shut it down. Absolute Amazing. knockout wearing Gian Battista Valli. Wow. And of course there you see the cape over the shoulders. I love that yeah. for a bit of drama. Oh. And then speaking of capes and drama, we've got um, Amelia Clark as yes. well of um, Game of Thrones um, fame, looking absolutely stunning. And this is a Valentino dress actually in the black lace. I almost never recognize her because we're so used to her with a white blonde. Yes, hair. She's yes actually it's Khaleesi. <laughs> Khaleesi, love it. Oh. Abs absolutely stunning. Can get away with it. Yeah, she can. No, really. I mean, she's got she's got that look, you know, such drama. More low and plunge. And then loads of low <laughs> plunge. This was definitely a big trend on the red carpet. Chan Channing Tatum's wife as well looked just so sensational on this number here in the middle. I'm not sure about Kirsten Dunst, Valentino dress there with the strapping. Yeah, it's got yeah. quite a large bust. And I don't know work. so much no, about that. No. I think it's better if you're a little bit small busted. And then we saw loads of these strapless bandu numbers, a little bit of a 90s throwback. Um, Kate Hudson's is actually, it looks like the separate bandu in a skirt, but it yeah. actually was joined at the back was where it? the zip was. Okay. So we saw lots of those strapless numbers that I'm sure they had to suffer with the whole night. Let oh. me tell you, suffer <laughs> for beauty, but they were beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely stunning. Like you said, I think every single woman owned on that red carpet. Absolutely. Hey? Nice. I did indeed. I have to say my favorite it was probably Lily James's look. Oh. That white dress just did it for That's me. Perfect. But we have to ask the guys, you know, Ewan, what did you think of the Golden Globes looks? 